Hey Mike, I have your uh, design ready for you to review. Uh, I just want to give, get a preview of it before I uh, send it out. I have a couple of quirks I got to work out before I mail it out tomorrow, uh, but I did want to give you a uh, look at it. All right, so uh, here's the, um, the front elevation. As far as the uh, floor plans go, um, I did relocate your front door to be within this front porch. Um, on the porch, I did a barrel vault ent entry over the front door. And then um, for each individual uh, bay between the columns, I added arches um, over the columns uh, just because I liked the way it looked on the front elevation. Um, I think you're going to like this. Um, so I've got uh, the basic layout. I did arched windows in uh, two spots on the second floor. You can decide if you really want to use those. Um, they are a lot more expensive than a standard double hung. Uh, but I did the uh, the lights, the muttons, uh, only in the top sash. Uh, kind of gives it a Hamptons look. Um, I didn't know if you were going to do new siding on the exterior of the house as opposed to the existing white that you're going to uh, match uh, painted cedar shake. Uh, but um, Here's the barrel vault that I was talking about, and then arches, arch trim uh, between the column bays. Um, so you can get an idea of what the uh, the house looks like this way. Okay, and um, this is, I believe, a, uh, let me see, I think I got a H12 roof pitch on the front peaks. And the main roof pitch is a 912, and that does comply with zoning. You have a maximum zoning height of 35 feet, so you'll be fine with the uh, zoning. So back to the floor plan. I relocated your front door and the mudroom from this area here. Uh, relocated it here. That takes away space from the existing bedroom in this area. Uh, we really didn't discuss what you wanted to do with the first floor plan as far as the uh, remaining bedrooms and the kitchen. I know you did say you were going to wind up renovating it probably, uh, so we'll go over that. Um, I took out the staircase that was hidden in the hallway. You can use that for uh, coat closets. I've got the staircase now going up from the front door, uh, more of a center hall colonial uh, look to it, going up to a landing and then up to the second floor. Um, on the second floor, I've got the open stairwell with the front window over that barrel vaulted peak to give you a nice light um, in the hallway. And I've got a very nice size, over, uh, oversized master bedroom, double door entry. Um, I've got a walk-in dressing area with a walk-in uh, closet. And this is your access into your existing uh, garage attic. Uh, for future consideration, if you want to try and do something with that uh, garage, if you want to rip the roof off and do a more steeply pitched roof and create a bonus room in there, this will be your direct access through the center line of the roof. Um, I've got a large master uh, bathroom here, dual linen closets, dual sinks, uh, water closet, large stand-up shower, and a jacuzzi tub, and then sharing a wet wall I have a common bath for the kids with a linen closet. Um, and then I've got uh, three nice size uh, bedrooms for your kids. Um, I tried to get in walk-in closets for, for the kids because um, more and more houses are doing that now. But the house doesn't have the depth uh, to do walk-in closets. Uh, but, I mean, uh, this is still the first draft of the design, so tell me what you think. Uh, maybe the, maybe, uh, on your end, you'll think the master bedroom is too large, and I'll I'll try and cheat and take some square footage away from that and move the uh, the bathrooms down to the left on the rear of the house and maybe make this uh, bedroom in the back larger. But I was trying to stack this wet wall over this wet wall downstairs. Um, there is another wet wall, as you can see here, but uh, it's not much use in this floor plan right now. So all the wet wall uh, plumbing will be in this wall. But uh, I'll have uh, the designs out to you tomorrow, uh, hard copies. Um, I just have a couple of things I want to tweak before I uh, print it out. As far as uh, pictures for you, um, I have um, this overview shot. I have the sideways shot, and uh, these will all be posted to the uh, website, but uh, you can take a look at them, get a preview of them this afternoon or this evening, 
and then uh, you should have hard copies within two days. All right, if you want to email me uh, any comments or questions, uh, feel free. I'll talk to you soon.